How's it going YouTube? Electronic Mechanic. Did a little modification in the tool cart today. This is a laptop mount. I've wanted a laptop mount for a while to be able to mount this here and have a laptop on the cart. The location seems to be okay. I went back and forth, you know, for a really long time trying to figure out where I wanted it on the cart and I think this is okay. My side table will still work um, and the laptop is kind of you know out here in the open and uh, I can you know turn it this way so if you're standing at the cart you can uh, do some research on it. It's a little high um, so I may lower it down but then it won't be able to turn and go above here, which isn't a big deal. I mean, I'll still be able to turn it to like, to like that, which is fine. So I might lower it down on that pole. Um, this kit that I ordered on Amazon, it's just a cheap Chinese um, monitor mount, but it also has a, uh, um, the option for well it's a laptop mount but it has the option for a monitor which i might put on here i'm not sure might have to cut this down ever so slightly but uh, it has the option for uh, a tall monitor so you can have a secondary monitor on the top um, and, uh, it gives you it gives you this other arm which I might use for the laptop honestly just because it's a double articulating arm um, but I uh, just wanted you guys to see this this is how I mounted it I just drilled four holes some bolts and these are the existing bolts and I had to I had to uh, countersink them into the bracket slightly because they weren't quite long enough but uh, on the inside here it's just uh, four socket head bolts, which I had to use socket head down here, um, down on the bottom two screws there because they're real close to the, they're actually right up against the uh, screwdriver tray through that double thick metal. And then this bracket here is part of the old L-shaped bracket that used to clamp it to the desk. And I just ran it through the bandsaw, trimmed it down and it's threaded for those two bolts on the outside and I just kind of added it for a little extra rigidity because this this panel here isn't super thick um, and you can see the there's bolts there go through and I uh, just use bolts and nuts and uh, it's actually really sturdy I was surprised I thought I thought it'd be really uh, flimsy but it ain't it's really strong so wanted to show you guys that maybe you want to do this to your uh, toolbox thanks for watching